Hey guys, what's up? I'm Justin. I'm here with Richard, and guys, we are going to talk about a big, well, not much of a big question for this Brewers team, but at their shortstop position. Uh, before we get to that, let's bring in Richard. Richard, what's going on, man? Not too much, not too much. Yeah, he's chilling out, um, playing some MLB 11 and 2K11, whatever you have. Um, Richard, let's talk about the shortstop position. What did you read about on MLB Trade Rumors? Uh, well, the Brewers are seeing some shortstop depth. Uh, I didn't really know if it was a surprise to me, but they're starting shortstop as Union. Union's keep that in court, and they have Craig Council, who is just going to die in their backup. Yeah. yeah. Um, who. Ta let's talk about how well both of these guys are doing. What do you have on Betancourt right now? Because I don't know very much about Betancourt, except all I know is is that he came over in the Zach Greinke cherry a trade that sent a lot of the main prospects from Milwaukee over to that team. What do you have? How well is Yuneski batting and stuff like that? Uh, well, last season he had a great year, 16 home runs, 70 RBI, with a 259 average. This year off to a slow start, back 212 with no homers and only one RBI. Uh, you know, I don't really care if you ask him that court too much. He's a below average shortstop. He's actually, according to the similarity score section of baseball reference, he's uh, uh, close, most similar. He's really similar to Angel Barilla, who was one of his teammates, and second on the list is Jason Bartlett. Uh, play for the Rays, and I don't really care too much with Bartlett either. I think he's a one average shortstop, and I don't think that if the Brewers want to make a run, I think they need to replace him. Yeah. Um, going over to the Craig Counts, I mean, well, let's just stay on UNESCO real quick. Is is it, they, were, they acquired him thinking that he's going to have a great outing for this team. Is UNESCO going to be gone by this deadline? I think he'll be gone. I, I just think that he's going to be on the bench, probably. He might be gone. I mean, definitely don't rule it out. Uh, but I think that he'll probably start on the bench. Or if they're going to get a shortstop, they'll still be starting. But I expect him to get a different kind of shortstop. Yeah. Um, so let's talk about the veteran shortstop. Uh, I think he's still, I think he's second oldest at ranking at the shortstop position, Craig Council. Um, how old is he, um, Richard? Do you know, I don't know how old he is right now. Is he close to the 40s? Uh, he's 40, he actually is. He's 40 years old. Um, yeah, he does a very storied career uh, in baseball, definitely. Yeah. Um, he's like a guy who will hit baseball. Well, he's a backup shortstop right now. Um, will this guy ever have... At least a 16 home run season again, just to throw something out there. Uh, no, the most home runs ever in a season is nine. I don't see him cracking double digits, especially being age 40 and not being a backup right now. Um, he's actually he's had seven at bats. He's hitless, uh, batting a zero. I, I just think he's mainly going to be a backup uh, shortstop. Yeah. Um, I don't even know where I had. I never even knew he hit his like he actually hit not only nine home runs was the most he ever hit. So I don't know where I was coming out of sixteen. So I apologize for that. Um, but Richard, who would you think will be a good candidate to be the starting shortstop for the Brewers? Who do you think that who is like your favorite candidate to go after for the if you're the Brewers? Well, if the Brewers are willing to make a run uh, to, for a do or die this year. I think if they could go out to Jose Reyes, he might be available. Uh, that'd be amazing if they could have managed to acquire him. That really put them over the top. Um, Steven Drew might be he's a trade candidate, which I, I don't really think that he will be traded, but it's possible. Um, you know, there's the free the free agents that are available. There are many short stuff for agents. Josh Wilson, who I don't think would could serve as an everyday. Uh, Julio Lugo, who I think is awful. But there are two guys, uh, Bobby Crosby and Christian Guzman, who aren't, uh, you know, totally awful. I like Crosby actually a little bit. Christian Guzman had a couple of good years in Washington. I think that if they were willing to look at, as far as the city agent market, maybe some of these guys to a mile league deal, um, uh, be 
minimum to load them. I think they make pretty decent fit. But uh, I'm, I don't know. We'll just have to see. Yeah, I mean, there are a lot of questions you can ask. Uh, and this team is expected to be in first place this season. Uh, I have high hopes for this uh, Brewers squad, and I heard that you might have high hopes for this team, but um, is there... Could you consider that the Jose Reyes going to the Brewers? Is there by any chance that Jose Reyes will go to the Brewers? Uh, right now, I think it's... I give it a 25 percent chance. That's pretty good. Uh, the Brewers have some prospects that they could have managed to trade for him. Uh, they have some players they could trade for him. Um, like uh, I'm trying to think of some players off the top of my head. Maybe they could package him as a back court. Uh, he would not really go ahead and be traded. But I definitely think that they could acquire Reyes. Um, they 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 go quite a bit. But uh, if they were doing it uh, an all or nothing year, I think they would be smart to do that. Yeah. So, I think the signing, I, do you think, going back to the Jose Reyes thing, I mean, that was just a big thing you just threw out there. Um, I just had a couple questions to ask you. If Jose Reyes is to come to the Brewers, could it be a possible stay for um, your boy Prince Fielder? Uh, well, it probably. Uh, the, it's not a matter, it's a matter of money, and it can't the Brewers afford him and Reyes, because Reyes is a free agent, too. That uh, might be pretty costly. Uh, I mean, unless Prince really wanted to take some sort of a discount or something, I'm not sure. But, uh, I, I think that, I think that it's uh, a 30% chance that the field is gone. If they get Reyes and can manage to afford both of them, definitely I can see and trying to say if they could keep Reyes as well. Yeah, so, uh, I'm mean, I just really excited on what you said about how he, that could actually happen. Um, I'm hoping that could actually happen. I mean, if you have that, uh, that kind of caliber shortstop, Jose Reyes, that shortstop for your team, you could possibly win something, but he's always injured, um, so it's a pretty big question for Jose coming if he actually joins the Brewers, so. Um, there you guys have it. Will the Brewers get a big time shortstop name? Could they get a minor uh, minor name? You name it, Christian Guzman. Could it be getting Bobby Crosby from free agency, uh, Josh Wilson, Julio Lugo, some of the top name shortstops out there. Um, you let us know. Will this team ever get that shortstop that they really need? I mean, Uneski not pulling through. Craig Council not even having a pretty much of not bad or probably. Not even a hit yet. He doesn't have a hit yet. So, um, questions are open at shortstop for this team. You let us know who will get that shortstop position. We'll talk to you later and enjoy baseball.